Hi everyone, this is Sneha. Hope you guys are doing well. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about how education does not equal to consciousness. So let me get started. See, we as a society like to judge others based on where they have gotten their education, what degrees they have. And then based on that, we add a value associated to them. But see, an education is not necessarily defining that somebody is smart. I have a master's in computer science. I'm also project management certified. And I know and I've worked with various people of various degrees throughout my career. Having all these certificates, having all these fancy degrees does not mean that someone is smart. It means that they did pay for that education and they can memorize things and they can regurgitate facts, but that does not mean that they can think for themselves. And we saw that these last couple of years. These PhDs, the doctors that could not see through the mass psychosis. And when we as a society believe that the doctors cared about us, and maybe they did, but they were unaware. They were not conscious. And there were people like me who don't have these fancy degrees that were able to see through the lies. See, critical thinking is a skill that lots of us could master. Now that is part of consciousness because the other part of consciousness is listening to our gut instincts and our intuition. Having that faith when we listen to our heart. That's the base premises for manifestation. Because our mind is part of it, but our heart is the second part of it. Law of attraction, law of assumption, law of vibration. All three of this, they're all tied with our mind and our heart. And if we take some time to reflect on people and individuals rather than looking at degrees and judging them based on that or judging based on where they got that degree. I know people who went to big schools, I'm not gonna say where, but they couldn't see through the lies. And I just went to UC Irvine. In fact, I know even classmates of mine that couldn't see through the lies. It was a wide range of people. And I think it all goes to being that conscious creator. It goes to being aware being self-confident and thinking outside that box, taking those risks. And that has no correlation to the degrees that one has. And as we individually start recognizing this, as we start creating our life consciously, we can create a better future for ourselves and our future generations. So take that time to see people beyond these degrees and get to know them for who they are before we blindly trust them and put them on a pedestal. In fact, the first person we should put on a pedestal is ourselves. Now, I'm not trying to be narcissistic because it can go to that point. We need to also be humble on this aspect. But that's the fine line that we as individuals will learn as we become more empathetic. And that is what being a human is, being empathetic, from my perspective as the leader. On that note, uh, if you like my video, please like it. If you have any comments or suggestions, I'd appreciate it. And um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank you. Have a great one. Bye.